here we are uh, at the start of a new project. Uh, gonna show you guys the start to finish on how to build the new fireplace. Uh, I'm gonna try to include as much of everything as I can along the way. Uh, this one's a little bit different because it's an existing house and it has an existing chimney on it. It's a vinyl chimney and it has a metal firebox in there that people want to remove it and put a real wood burning masonry fireplace. Uh, I'm going to take you along every step of the way that I can and show you how I build a fireplace. It might not be the same as what you've seen somewhere else or what's built in other parts of the country. Um, so here we go. I will we're gonna start padding this out with plywood uh, and set up scaffolding so the carpenters can come and do the removal and get, get ready for laying brick. Down on this side.
All right, here we go. Finish up some actual head cam footage. Hand me those plank. Oh, you could have handed them from the ground. One more. You want to get the outriggers up here? Yep. And uh, we need two plank for those as well. We'll just set them up right at the top because they're going to be needing them right at the top first, I think, to take all this apart. Perfect. Yep, no, you ought to be able to hand them from the side over here.
Can you get it to me or not? There you go. Okay. All right. Here we go. We're in good position. Gotta go up a couple feet from here when we do our brickwork. So this will be a good spot for stock, a mud board. And this will also be a spot for stock and mud boards. Mud board in the middle, brick on each side. And then every level is the same. Uh, toss me the tape measure. Oh, it's down here somewhere. Right here. I just want to see how far away we actually are because we got to go up a couple feet beyond what this already is. Underhand. It is so ugly how they do this at the top. It's all siliconed in like just a piece of sheet metal.